and I got a time there. So. Today we're going to show you the uh, basic differences in the three types of uh, Whirlpool tubs. First we have a uh, pipe tub invented by the Jacuzzi Brothers uh, back in the 50s. Uh, what it does is it pulls water through a uh, big suction fitting, through one big pump on the end of the tub, and distributes, distributes it to all the jets uh, through a maze of pipes on the outside of the tub. Uh, when you turn it on, it's going to turn that big pump on, it's going to pull all the water in through uh, the big suction fitting through this big pipe, and then distributes it, distributes it to all the jets through these pipes. It's also going to pull water, in, I mean, pull air into the system as well. Uh, so you turn it off, the pipes all backfill with water. Uh, when you drain the pipes, a lot of, or drain the tub, a lot of the water is going to drain out of those pipes, but because of the sticky nature of water, it's not all going to drain out. Um, so you're going to have a damp, dark, uh, and warm environment, for, which is perfect for breeding bacteria. Uh, so stuff starts to grow in those pipes. A lot of people say they turn their tub on and the black stuff comes out, or the rush of cold water comes out. Um, that's all from the previous bath. Uh, so you can see things starting to grow in here, and it also feed off of uh, whatever comes off of your body the oils and skin cells and dirt and it's all going to get trapped in those pipes very diff difficult to clean you can fill it flush it with, or put bleach in it drain the tub fill it again to flush it so you're using a whole lot of water and a whole lot of time to clean that system um, so several decades later they invented the air tub which is uh, another kind of whirlpool it's got a blower on the end it's going to blow air through an air channel on the outside, which is uh, a concealed pipe. Uh, you're just getting a lot of bubbles in the tub. It's moving the water just by blowing air through small holes. When you turn this tub on, it's very loud. A lot of people would compare it to a jet engine. Uh, and again, you're just getting water, I mean, air bubbles into your tub. Cold air is going to cool down your bath very quickly. On this, we've shown how the uh, cutaway to show how the uh, channel backfills with water when you turn the pump off. Uh, when you drain the tub, a lot of that water is going to drain out. Um, and after a certain amount of time, the blower will come back on and uh, do what they call a warm air purge, which is going to uh, blow some of the water out of the pipe, but Again, not all of the water is going to find its way out of the pipe. You're left with a damp, cool, dark environment, which is a perfect breeding ground for bacteria. Um, so you're not getting a whole lot of hydrotherapy value because all you're getting is air blown into the tub, um, and it's also very loud, and you have the same cleaning issues where you cannot get into the system to effectively clean it. With our tub, we have invented a pipeless system. Every jet has its own motor directly behind it. So it pulls the water in and shoots it straight back out. So behind every jet, you'll see on our tub, you'll see a uh, motor cantilevered off the back. This is an AC induction motor, like a ceiling fan. So they're very long life, they're very uh, reliable, and they're also very quiet. Here we have our um, <clears throat> Elite control pad. Because we have independent jets, we can control the jet pairs independently. So we can turn all of the jets on. We can also turn each pair on high, low, or off, off independently of each other. We also have some pre-programmed massage modes like pulse, linear, random, aerobic, and we also have two memory settings. So once you find what you like, you can hold this memory button down and it's gonna save it. Uh, so next time you get in the bath, you can go right back to where you were. We have a, a 9 LED uh, light in the tub, which can cycle through colors. You can stop on what you like. Or you can color wash through all the colors. So in addition to being very, the quietest tub on the market, our tub is also incredibly easy to clean. The way it works is it pulls the water in through all the small holes and shoots it out through the big hole. So with an eighth of a turn, these pop off by hand. It's all made out of ABS plastic. All this can go in the dishwasher. Uh, the water never actually leaves the tub, so everything that touches water 
can be touched, it can be scrubbed, it can be cleaned, it can be um, visibly inspected so that you know everything is completely um, sanitized and cleaned. Because of that, we are independently certified by NSF to get to a level two D EPA disinfection level in under five minutes um, uh, using half a gallon of water. So you're saving quite a bit on water when you clean the tub, you're saving a whole lot of time, and you know that your tub is 100% disinfected after every use. If you were to neglect the system and not clean it, uh, you can always go back and clean the system back to as clean as it was the day you bought it. Because of this technology, because of our technology, um, we have been uh, installed in many hospitals throughout the country with uh, typically in labor and delivery for pain management. And we also are um, big in the spa industry as well as the hospitality industry because of the ease of cleaning, the quietness, and uh, several of our other benefits. Serviceability, maybe? Serviceability is very simple. Everything is modular, and we have a patent on the fact that every piece can come out from inside the tub. So if a motor were to ever go out, you pop the jet off. Uh, there's four screws that are uh, use J-latches to hold it onto the tub. All that comes out through the inside of the tub, um, and it's plug and play. So you can put a new one in there, tighten it up with a screwdriver, and you're ready to go for the brand new jet. All of the electronic controls um, also come out from behind this keypad. This is a decal, pull it, pop the decal off. It's got two screws back there and everything that controls the tub electronically can come out through that hole. So there's no need for any kind of access panels. Um, everything is accessed from inside the tub. We want to put them all on for sound just one last time. Turn them off one at a time. Our tub is half as quiet as a typical pipe whirlpool tub and four times quieter than a typical air tub. So, quieter than a um, typical conversation. It would be even quieter than this once it's installed uh, with a surround. Uh, a lot of people buy our tubs for the quietness or for the cleanliness. And once they get it installed, they love, they always comment on the quietness because they can sit in the tub, they can read a book, they can have a conversation, they can watch TV.